I'm from the bay, that's how we speak. I'm from the bay. I'm from the bay. Hey, welcome back to the channel. We're doing yet again another Subaru WRX video. Today, we will be installing uh, one of those flashing modules onto the real third brake light. So the one that's in the windshield. The easy process. I already got this out. There it is right here. It literally, you just push in on the back of it and lift up. And then you go in the trunk and you unplug it. It's all right there in the open. So we're gonna be replacing it today with uh, this. We're just gonna be adding this onto it. It's a little product like this from Amazon. GS100A. Type that in, uh, type that in on the search bar on uh, Amazon and it'll come up with two of these. Uh, two pack for $9.99. I got this like a year ago when I did the the brake light down there um, and I just had this one sitting so I decided why not try it and uh, put it onto the, this brake light so that way this one and that bottom one blink at the same time plus it's just sitting there but literally just type that in GS 100A on the search bar and this will pop up a two pack for $9.99 uh, as you can see, it says VN. So this one goes to the car harness, towards the car harness, and then out goes towards the tail light. So on this, let me flip you around here. So on this then, here it is. The end part will go this way, towards the top of it with the plug that goes to the car. The out part will get in here that goes to the light. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna just split this with like a razor blade, cut a section out, and then uh, connect this guy into it. So what you're gonna need is, let me see, make sure I got everything here for you guys. We're gonna need some of these heat shrink. This also came from Amazon. I use these a lot. And then we're gonna need wire strippers. The best wire strippers you can get you just put the wire in there squeeze it strips it for you these are from Mako but they have a bunch of other brands and then we're gonna need a lighter for the heat shrink and then where are you at a razor blade to cut the, the plastic tubing so these are the tools you're gonna need right here install this so let me go ahead and uh, get some stuff going here and I'll put you guys uh, I'll show you guys what I did afterwards okay so quick little thing uh, when I cut it open it's not a red and black wire it's a blue and black wire so you're gonna connect the red on this to the blue on this and then the black on this to the black on that and then uh, that's it just plug and play just wanted to show you this real quick as you can see Here's the tail light. It's on the outside. The black to black, I just uh, stripped them back with the wire strippers, twisted them together, and then now to heat shrink it, you just go like this with the lighter. And that's it. It's heat shrinked. It's on there, it's good, it's watertight. You don't have to worry about it. So I'm gonna continue this process with all the other ones and then I'll get back to you guys once it's all done. Okay, here we go. Let me put this down. As you can see, it's there. Red to blue, black to black. That's the outside. The inside goes to the car. Red to blue, black to black. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, put this bring you over here with me sorry if it's all shaky right here as you can see there's the the little uh hole where this goes right there it's slippery as heck back here 
okay? Just feed that through there. That's all you need to do, feed that through there. You don't even need to put that part in. Come back over to here. Here's the plug. Right there, there's the hole, here's the plug. You just plug this back in here like this. That's it. Now, we're gonna go ahead and put that like that, just to make sure it works. Let's see, when I hit the brakes. There we go. Nice, I like that. Okay, let's get out of here. Go back in the back seat here. And here you are right here like this. So then you just grab this. I'm gonna have to set you down for a minute. But we're gonna just tuck this little module behind this section right here where there's that opening. And then uh, you just push it in like that and click it back into place and that's it. So let me go ahead and set you down and I'll let you see what it looks like when I'm done. That's it. Went on quick and easy. If you want to remove it, you just push right there. Push right there and lift up at the same time. See, pops right out. That's it. So that's it. Quick, easy little install. Um, like I said, that part was $9.99 for two of them. Uh, so a two pack for 10 bucks. Sorry for the noise for the compressor. I gotta put air in my wife's tire. But that was it. Quick, easy little install. It makes the back of the car look like an F1 car. Uh, I'll install a clip after this of both of them going off, like all the brake lights working at once, so you can see what it looks like. Um, if you like that mod, just type in GS100A in the Amazon search bar. It'll pop up. Uh, until then, I'll see you guys on the next video. Stay safe. Comment down below what you guys think of it. Like this video and subscribe. See you guys later. Peace. Do it again.